Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, yeah, for our drawing, hang on, I'm drawing one of, if not the first character on my channel to have a backstory uh, that I will be talking about later. Here, uh, if you can notice, the page is really yellow or brown or whatever color. Uh, that's because I find it's a lot easier to draw the character on paper, take a picture, and then transfer it to a digital art style. So, that's why it looks weird. The lighting is just super awkward. So, just keep that in mind. But, um, yeah. So, this is a Rainwing Sandwing hybrid uh, that I colored. And I will talk, and we'll be right back as soon as we get a little more into the detailing. This character has a prehensile tail, well, the frills, venom, ma and can change color, just like the rain wings. But everything else is very sand wing like. Uh, he lives in the desert. Well, lives is a very loose term. He's usually on the move because he's an assassin who has a wife, and the wife has a kid. And if you want to see me draw those characters as well, uh, let me know. I do have, like, character references for that. But there's a whole backstory on how they met, but I don't know if I'll get into that today because that's a longer story. And right now, I think we're just going to get into this character. But, um, this character is very hostile and doesn't have a lot of friends. He's got maybe one or two friends that he's made. But they're less of friends and more of colleagues. Anyway, uh, as you can see here, I start coloring it looking at him, this like more yellow color that's a little closer to Sunny's color in the book. But uh, I quickly decided I really hated that. Like, I just, the yellow was throwing me off. I couldn't do it. So I started over 
with a much more toned down color tone. A lot more sand-like, if you can believe it. His coloring is almost entirely sand wing, with a couple bright yellows thrown in, and a little bit of green. But other than that, it really is just the sand wing colors. Um, anyway, I ended up naming the character Cactus, because a uh, desert plant, rain wing, sand wing, just, it all kind of came together. Uh, as you can see here, I originally colored those dots the same yellow, but then I decided there wasn't enough color variation, and it was looking really bland, so then I changed the color up to green. Uh, yeah. One of the original names is going to be Diamondback, uh, because there's a lot of diamonds along the character. Oh my gosh, I, I just realized. I could have made the circles into diamonds instead, but I didn't. And it would have been perfect because it would have meshed the sand wing and the rain wing scale pattern. Oh my gosh. Well, hindsight 2020. Um, yeah. Anyway... Yeah, uh, he's, he's very stealthy, as most assassins are. Kind of like, uh, Deathbringer, but a whole lot less, like, smooth. He's more of just, I do job, I finish, that's it. Next job. Uh, he has absolutely no sense of humor, and it's generally considered very bland by people he meets but that's really like most of his personality yeah he's you're very bland everyday man until you realize he's an assassin and he could literally kill you so you know uh very funny in senses like that
as you can see here, uh, I was going to give him, like, accessories, but I decided against it. Uh, anyway. Uh, yeah, that's the end. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I will, I can't wait to see you next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below on what dragon you want to see next. If you want to see a dragon I've already made, or if you have a recommended idea. Anything you'd like. Uh, see you later.